kind of something like that Shakespeare would have wrote it, yeah to take a picture to do this like um, color analysis test and I've always wanted to know what's my personal color you know when you watch those um, Korean beauty gurus they always say if you are a cool autumn or like, if you are a warm summer then you should use this shade and you know because I'm like damn vain right so I want to know what's my perfect shade but I have no idea because I don't know what's my personal color so my friend told me about this TikTok filter so I'm gonna try it and she said to pin your hair back which is why I pinned all my hair back and I learned it now Wait, wait, oh! Wait, 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 I'm gonna describe. Did they put filter? Oh my god, yes, the TikTok has a filter. Okay, let's go again. Okay, she looks awesome. Did they randomly put a random song? <laughs> anyway, here it is. I'll put a picture here. Please tell me what you think is mine so if you're not sure basically how you're supposed to do it is you compare all the pictures and the one that um, can like turn to your skin best is your personal like color group basically the one that makes your skin look more lively and bright yeah I just showered and I'm about to get ready. It's my hair week right now and I've just been very sleep deprived. Every morning I also have to get ready really fast because I don't really have time. So I just thought I could show you guys what skincare products I've been using. By the way, this segment of the video is sponsored by Parnell and Addict. Parnell is a recently launched Korean skincare brand for sensitive skin. And Addict is a brand that produces non-ethanol and non-toxic perfume. I just thought I could show you guys the products from them that I've been using which has helped me a lot during my hell week, honestly. So over the past few weeks, I've been using this as my toner. It's the Parnell Sika Manu Cotton Clear Pad. And you can really see the liquid inside, which keeps the pads like soaked and nice. So it's really easy to use. You just open it like that. And there's a tweezer here so that you won't contaminate all the pads when you are getting one. So for this brand, the main ingredient of their skincare is Sika Manu. And Sika Manu is actually a blend of Sika and Manuka honey. So it's better for sensitive skin and it'll keep your face smooth without like irritating your skin. Then the next thing I use is their cream. And when Panel reached out to me, I actually chose this cream because I've combi skin but because of how much I've been wearing masks you know, in school when you sweat while wearing your mask my skin just got quite dry around like this area so I got this cream because I wanted to really hydrate my skin it looks really thick but I was really really surprised because when you apply it onto your skin like that and then I just do this and after it melts into your skin it's really not oily or greasy which I was really surprised about now I'll quickly move on with sunscreen Okay, and now for the game changer. So if you guys watched my 
past makeup videos you know that I don't really use cushion foundations because to be honest I told you guys just now I have combi skin so I tried to go for those matte cushions but some of them were really dry for me around this area but this one I've been using the past week and it's been super quick and easy for me to get ready in the morning and to do a very quick gluey makeup just before school mmm it smells nice Can I see? I'm gonna do a comparison with my face at the beginning before I apply the cushion. Compare my face before and after I did my base and brows. So much difference. And that is my quick and easy makeup. And I did that it because I haven't blow dry my hair. So let me go blow dry my hair now. And then for today's scent, Benedict sent me two EDPs. Look at how aesthetic the packaging is. And they also sent me two solid perfumes. The coolest part about these perfumes is that it's ethanol free. It's actually water based. You can see it has two layers. And before you use it, you have to shake. You know with normal perfumes, you can't directly spray it on your hair because of the alcohol inside which will really dry out your hair but because these are water-based and ethanol-free, it's actually even safe to spray on your hair So the first scent is The First and I really like this a lot It smells like baby powder It brings me back to those days where I was a kid and my mom would apply baby powder on me And then the other scent they gave me is this Eat the Peach And this is, like the name suggests, it's a very peachy smell not peachy ah, uh, peachy. <laughs> they both smell very clean and they're also quite light so personally I think they're good for days when I want to smell good but I don't feel like having that overpowering perfume smell. And for the solid perfumes, the website said to apply on your pulse points so I just squeeze it out like this and I thought it would be oily but it just fits into your skin like that. Do you see how it blends so seamlessly? Yeah, and then it just completely fades away and you forget it's there. The one I just applied is sandalwood and the other one I have is musk. And between the two, I prefer sandalwood. The musk one reminds me of a candle. And the sandalwood one is just a very warm and therapeutic scent. Oh my god. And I read online that if you apply a lotion before you apply your perfume, it will last longer. So another thing you can actually do is to apply these solid perfumes first and then layer on with the EDP and it will last longer and also you get a more unique scent. So today I just applied the sandalwood and I'm gonna use Eat the Peach today. Okay, yep, so that's about it. I'm gonna leave haul soon. If you guys are interested in any of the products I mentioned just now, I'll leave the relevant information and links down in the description box down below. So don't forget to check out Parnell and Edit! I realized I forgot that this is a what I eat in a day and not a vlog <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to South Spine for lunch now so I was thinking if I want duck rice or this then my boyfriend asked me to eat this he said Duck rice every day? Are you ducky? Ta-da! And not number two, please. Why? With money. Yes. A little broad. Okay, so today we're eating this unhealthy chicken pocket. My mom always calls me when I eat this because she says it's very, very unhealthy. 
because of the skin um, but I ran out of healthy food to eat I've been trying to eat healthy the past two weeks and I've officially ran out of healthy food so I'm both eating this today this is $4.50 it comes with the chicken and cake at the bottom and complimentary soup that you can scoop Our group presentation, so Yay. we are taking a research mod together, and this is our second group to like group project together, right? Second, that time we did, second, the time we did, I the, did the Chloe one, you know? yeah, that one. How did this place our second one? Eh? Yeah, oh, I think it went pretty well, yeah, pretty well. Yeah, now I'm gonna help her take IG pics. <laughs> yeah, I need her to help me take some photos. Yeah, hey, go this way. Then, hey, the sun nice, hey, the sun nice. Hey, yeah, and me, you look cute. <laughs> you look cute. <laughs> Like a bear. Wow, sounds so bright. I always get nervous before I order Thai Fan because like, I haven't seen the Liao in time yet. Then also kind of very short, right? So I need to tiptoe to like, look at all the different layout. Then I'm damn scared I cannot see in time. I cannot decide in time because it's like damn long queue behind. Mm -hmm. Okay, Yay! Okay. Right. Right. Okay, I got pork, uh, steamed egg, and mako tofu. He got tauge, uh, unhealthy meat, and pork. so annoying. You know my stomach was growling like crazy while presenting. Then my friend kept on staring at me. Mm. I'm not gonna eat high fun. I wanted to eat um European but meat. Yeah it's so good. In course I have an audition at 7.30 so I didn't want to eat like too much. got accepted! Yay! <laughs> I didn't really perform to my best potential though. I don't know, I just kept feeling like there's air in my throat. Like, like, like there's air going to my throat and then I kind of messed up a bit here and there. Yeah. Maybe because I haven't performed that long time and I was a bit nervous. <laughs> yeah, but there was a lot of air in my throat. Now I'm like, <gasps> cannot really sing properly. 
I wanted to vlog, not really vlog, but I wanted to film my audition just to have some clips to show you guys but I was like really shy because it's my first time going there so I was too shy to ask if I can record uh, so I ended up not filming anything there <sighs> quite tired because it's been a long day okay I'm gonna end the vlog here thank you guys so much for watching um, but actually maybe tomorrow I will have a few bonus clips because I'm moving out of hall tomorrow so maybe I want to just film my room my empty room just for the sentimental value <laughs> in case I don't get that room back next sem